We're here today in front of this abandoned tanning salon. It's been abandoned for years. Uh, to show the, the true side of capitalism, the shadow of capitalism. Just kidding, just kidding. We're in front of Goodwill uh, on this first Saturday of the month, which is a special day for anyone that knows anything about Goodwill and saving money. First Saturday of the month is when everything in the store is half off. Um, so we're gonna try and find some deals on some stuff that we may or may not need. I don't know, we're all consumers in this cesspool of capitalism, so we're all trying to survive it. All right, let's try it. It's always the new Goodwills that have the, uh, the coolest things. This one's like less than a year old. And a lot of people, a lot of people have donated to it, but oh shit. That's funny. Uh, like I said before, it's the first Saturday of the month, so everything's, everything's half off. I do! Getting a lot of weird looks. This is also the most crowded time of Goodwill, which is why I try not to come. Unless I'm really looking for something in particular that Goodwill has, which is rare. I could use a top, though. You ever, you ever make a burger on the stove and you want to melt cheese on it? and you don't got any tops that you could like cover over the burger, this is the perfect solution. And I think I'm gonna do that with a slightly smaller one. That's like burger size, right? That's 50 cents. Look at that. Already winning. I'm gonna go to my favorite section, which is the, which is the wood section. Just kidding, it's the electronics section over here. I probably chose the worst time to do this, but how else are you supposed to show off first Saturday without a first Saturday run, right? Fucking Chia Pet. <laughs> uh, that's classic. It's probably, it's probably broken inside. It's sealed, it's completely sealed, but it's probably broken. Oh, wait, another cashier at the front. They need another cashier at the front. We got all kinds of chaos going on over here. Oh shit. Oh. I get excited when I see anything at Goodwill with HDMI, but this is just a direct TV receiver. I don't know if you could do much with it. Not really familiar with this technology. Smart card. They're not gonna need that. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know if there's anything else you can do, like if you play media off of this thing or not. Yeah, it's, it's uh... Five ninety nine. So what is that? Times times point five. Two ninety nine. I don't feel like doing math. Oh hey, that's cool. Look at that. That's cute. I've got a bigger version of this. It's a little switcher. A to B. Daddy finger, daddy finger, where are you? Fucking Salesforce, man. Fucking swag. They are taking over. <laughs> I have no idea where they came out of. I know they do marketing, but is marketing really that big? Hmm. I guess it is. Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Super shaker, bed vibrator. Is this like an alarm system? Let me see what the other end looks like. It's probably gonna be audio. No, it's not. I don't know what the fuck this is. What the fuck? Does that have a timer on it? America's leader in visual alert systems. That's interesting. Probably has like a like a home base. Yeah, I've got one of these. Pretty useful. Don't need another one. Two ninety nine. Not bad. Oh, look at that. Coffee mug with composite out. It's pretty sweet. It's not as useful as time mug, but you know, if you want to visualize your coffee on a on a composite capable television, that's your safest bet. Good job, capitalism. Hmm. It's 
see what the fuck this is about. Link in the description. Because I'm the RCI guy, I'm Gross. also looks an disgusting. Fucking companies in their swag, man. Littering the landscape. Just littering the landscape. Oh shit. Hell yeah, dog. 99 99 Fuck out of here. Plus that's half of that, so that's 50 cents. What are you fucking stupid? Of course I'm getting it. <laughs> Emergency blanket. 50 cents. I'll consider it. You know what? I'm gonna get a cart. Oh, shit. You don't hate Mondays, you hate capitalism. A baby, they're not making memories. Just buy one of these fucking things. Why you gotta buy new, you fucking dumbass parents? Jesus Christ! Walker of time. Interesting. Oh man, it's a kids' book, but I love time travel. Hmm. Never read this one. I don't like when they go back in time, though. That's kind of boring. Like when they go forward in time. How do you do? Sister cat, sister cat, where are you? Here I am, here I am, how do you do? Oh, by the way, another thing, and it's part of the Goodwill ideology, so I don't really necessarily blame them, but... For example, Bibles are free. They're just free. You can just take them. I don't know, this is a... Looking for more of a... Classic. King James, even. Oh, no, that's NIV. Looks classic, though. Looks like a Bible. That's a Bible. Look at that. This is, this is the kind of shit you put your hand on. But, here's my question. What does Genesis 6, 6 say? We'll see. God, this is hard to do with one hand. Genesis... Is my favorite passage. The Lord was grieved that he had made man on this earth, and his heart was filled with pain. Genesis 6 6. Yep. So, Holy Bible. Pretty full of ideology, but depends how you read it, really. But yeah, I'm pretty sure. Actually, I'm gonna, I'm gonna test that theory. So, I've got a bunch of shit, and I'll, I'll buy all that, but I'm gonna ask whether or not Bibles are free, because I'm pretty sure they are. Me, 100% Flash. You, jealous. Flash like the, like Macromedia Flash? Pure storage. What does that mean? Fucking tech companies and their swag. Mm. Yeah, no, there's a lot of shirts that are just basically swag that people never wore. Actually, I think built for virtualization. Okay, I mean, a shirt's a shirt. You're gonna wear it. I mean, if you don't give a shit, whatever. LM Studios? LM? L? Is that an M? LM Studios. It's coming. See, nobody knows what it is. No one here, anyway. I don't know what it is. That's coming. But whatever. But there's nothing wrong with that. That's the, that's the, uh,. That's a system trying to correct itself. Capitalism is very wasteful, but that's why Goodwill exists. But there's not enough things like Goodwill. Now this is a mess. This is a fucking mess. Hey, ball. Will this video get more than 100 views? 
very uh <laughs> no wonder it's so fucking indecisive it's it's broken it's like right in the middle god damn it come on 100 views let's do this uh what does that say unlikely well it's my least popular series <laughs> so i'm really not surprised because there's nothing going on it's just it's just me walking through shit which is why i feel like it needs a change i really don't think i'm gonna keep calling it cheap chinese crap i think i need to rename it to something that's a little bit more consumer friendly like i don't know surviving capitalism or something like that not everything here is gonna get is gonna is gonna get bought honestly i mean i'm not gonna try and guess what it is that's not gonna get bought i'm sure this will get bought some bitch will think this is cute and like, oh, let's get it. Like, whatever. I get it. Oh, I guess I should explain this, by the way. <laughs> um, I have a theory that if you wear a wedding ring in public, you seem more trustworthy. And considering the looks that I'm getting right now for filming alone in a Goodwill, talking to myself, you know, I, I, need, all the, I need all the public trustworthy I can get. That's kind of cool. It's kind of greasy. I don't know. It's interesting. So yeah, I'm trying it out. People see me fucking filming shit, talking to myself. But then when they see the ring, they're like, oh, <laughs> don't worry, he's, he's, uh, he's got a care or something. You know, something like that. Father finger, father finger, where are you? Uh, so let's recap what I got here. Nothing really happened today. I've got a holy Bible that I'm going to test to see if it's free. I'm pretty sure it is. Oh, it's red letter, too. The word of Jesus ain't bad, though. He, it depends how you read him, but he's really not that bad. Uh, some of this, the, almost, uh, the huge bulk of this is ideology, but, I mean, what isn't? I got a really cheap, and it's full, really cheap, full, uh, compressed air. 99 cents divided by two is... 50! Good job. emergency blanket but it's really reflective so I might like use it as a lining for something that I need light reflecting and it's only 50 cents uh, a top a little top for my burgers so when I'm cooking burgers I can just melt the cheese on there you know shout a fucking thing that I got to clean shit I guess yeah I mean I you know whatever it's 99 cents divided by 0.5 uh, times 0.5 it is what it is I think I'm gonna just head to the checkout counter now uh, just for the record I don't believe in any of this crap they don't really check your credentials on whether or not you uh Judah Dorsey hmm that's a custom engraved one that's fun hopefully it is uh, no signal that's fine. All right, I'm gonna put you down. Don't panic. Hi, sorry. Um, good, how about you? Are Bibles free? Yeah, but I started out with Okay, cool. Good to know. Oh, fuck, it's so bright. But, uh, Goodwill, total, fucking 50, 50, 50, 50. Round it up to $3. And just to confirm, I mean, I took a picture of the, I took a picture of the screen, but the Bible was free. So Bibles are free at Goodwill for whatever reason. Because, you know, ideology. But it's a good, it's a good, it's a good kind of ideology. In a, in, a, in, a, in a way. Sometimes. I don't know. You decide on your own. I don't, I'm not your fucking dad. So, that was Goodwill. Uh, first Saturday of the month. Half off everything. Uh, and that's it, I guess. I mean, we're back where we started. So, uh, bye. Sometimes Goodwill prices are not fair, 
and that's when I bring in the great equalizer, the Goodwill stickers. If something's like grossly, grossly, grossly underpriced, overpriced, I, uh, I, I, I tend to bring in some equalizers depending on the color of the week. Uh, and, you know, it's it's a 100% profit for them anyway. It's not like they fucking donated to them. And it's a good cause, so I'm not going to, you know, don't get me wrong, it's, it's a little fucking fucked up, but so is paying mentally handicapped people below minimum wage. So no, you, you, you pick your battles, but you pick your battles. So if you're going to fucking cry me a river about it, why don't you start with uh, Goodwill's paying practice when it comes to people with uh, disabilities.